Hello, this is Tommy Too Smooth. When I'm in Philly, you know what I do? I listen to Ed 24-7 jazz. If you're not, you're lucky. <laughs> Hey y'all, it's your girl Ashley, Ashley Rice Music. When I'm home in my city, Philly, I'm always listening to watching Air 247. Come on y'all, stand up. I didn't fit it, but I rock it like a baby in the court. I put the water in the ocean in the city that I'm from. How you doing, bro? What's happening with you? I heard that you was on vacation this week, bro. Must be nice, bro. You know what I'm saying? What's up, bro? Well, bro, for the looks of it. It's like you on vacation every week, every day, like 365 days a year, because I don't believe Air 247 is a real job, you know what I'm saying? Like, where the benefits at, you know what I'm saying? Like, you probably don't have no benefits, no health care, none of that, bro. So, don't don't try to be funny and say, oh, you on vacation this week. Damn, Ryan, Ryan, man, why are you always serious, man? Like, man, I can't even joke with you, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I mean? Like, yeah, Air 247 is a real job. I get cake off that. You know what I'm saying? Way more than you make at the little septic job you got. You know what I'm saying? But, dude, you know, I got a question to ask you, bro. Why do stand-up comedians bring a chair on the stage to sit down? You know what I'm saying? Like, you're a stand-up comedian. Like, say, stand-up comedian uh, Mike C is on the night, right? But when he come out, he bring a chair out. So, I don't understand that. You know, you know what I'm saying? Like, shouldn't it be, like, uh, stand-up and sit down, comedian. Mike C is appearing tonight. Hmm. Makes you wonder why. Damn, bro. <laughs> you know what? You might got a point there, bro. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Because, you know, I see stand up comedians, like, like halfway through the act, they bring a chair out and sit down, put out a cigarette and a drink. They all got the same protocol. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So, you know what? You know, man, like, uh, what's up with you, man? I, I see you driving around that BMW, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, like, you think you the ish, you know what I'm saying? Like, but you really not. Because you know what BMW stand for, bro? Black man wishing I had lower payments. That's what they stand for, bro. You like, you be killing yourself making no payments. I know you do, bro. I can see it. And you, I can see it. I can see it, bro. When you, like, pull off and, like, damn, <laughs> the poor pay us some change for that, job. Yo, what you talking about, little bro? You know what, man? See, the jealousy stuff again, bro. I make enough money on Air 247 to buy anything I want, bro. I know, like, you driving that little Ford Escort 1976, John, man. <laughs> you know what, bro? If you want to borrow my car and act like me, you know, I'm more than willing to do that for you. But that little 76, though, you need to upgrade, bro, for real. You need to upgrade that, John, bro, because they ain't going to get it. They ain't going to cut the mustard, bro. Do you really know what time it is? I ain't talking about the clock in the back. Do you really know what time it is? Because you know what? I love my 76 Escort. It's blue, tinted windows, and I got the original rims on that joint, bro. You don't know, bro. When I pull up to the Trinity store, like 16th and Hans uh, Hanson Park, bro, yo, it's like, yo, it'd be like a lot of joints in it, right? And they come out, they be like, yo, man, look at that blue Escort. It's a 76, too. I get mad props, man. You know what I'm saying? Don't, don't be all jealous, bro. You know what I'm saying? Because... I love that drum, man. I'm going to keep it the rest of my life, bro. You know what I'm saying? I don't have no payments. No payments, bro. Zero payments. No car notes. You know what I'm saying? I don't even have insurance on that drum because you know what? I think they said 76. You don't really need to get insurance on it because it's a piece of it. But I love that car, bro. For real. I ain't going to hold you. What's up, man? You know what, little bro? Okay, if you like that little blue escort, you know, I like it too. All right, but I won't be borrowing it anytime soon. <laughs> That. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yo, uh, I just want to say before we get out of here, you know, I want all y'all young people out here, all older people too, stop the violence, man. Put the guns down. You know what I'm saying? Education is the key to success for real. You know what I'm saying? When you get far in life, you know, most educated, you know, you know, stick with education. And you know, try not to do any crimes, man, because jail is not fun, bro. For real, believe me. All right, so on that note, do your job, man. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to my son, Young Hitter. Doing this thing. All right. Oh, you know what? I forgot to tell you. Um, I got a special guest coming up on the show soon. Shelly Williams, man, from Urban Expressions. I'm um, single on this Saturday night. Um, she doing a lot of stuff, bro. Like, she like the Oprah Winfrey of the Philadelphia, Philly. So, that's a real important interview coming up um, real soon. So, you must definitely want to stay tuned for that. 
All right, so do your job, man. Everybody have a nice day or night, wherever you at. Peace.